Hey guys, it's Nick. I'm here in Kalamata on the waterfront. It is Sunday night, September 3rd, I guess, almost 10 o'clock at night. I want to see who's out here and see who is strolling along on the kind of promenade over here uh, at the port and then walk by the beaches and see who's out at night. So, it's a little late in the season right now. Um, when I came here a year ago, it was more like mid-August, and uh, there was a lot more people walking around after dinner and everything like that. But as you see, there are a lot of people out for a Sunday night. So I don't know if these are tourists and they don't have to work, or this is just local Greeks and they like to eat out late on Sundays, probably a mix of both. So I ate at this place last night, Olympic Cook, pretty good. So it's a nice setup here because the stores are across the street, but the, seat, the seats are right here on the water. They don't have to have all this square footage to serve a lot of people. And at night, it's really nice and cool, so it's the perfect weather. You don't need air conditioning or anything like that. And the dinner is also kind of the socializing, right? You don't just eat dinner and then leave and go to a bar. Uh, the restaurant becomes the bar with your friends and family. You just sit around and hang out and talk. So uh, a lot of these people might have eaten already. Like I said, it's almost 10 o'clock. Uh, now they're just having a beer or coffee or whatever and relaxing. Uh, last time when I was here, there was at least at least one like uh, one of those old-timey tourist ships that looked kind of like a pirate ship uh, in the dock here with information on tours. I don't see that now, so maybe the season is over for it. I'm not really sure. But uh, a lot of families out here with their kids and it's a very you know, safe place to come with your kids. You don't have to worry about them uh, even if they run off to play with other kids around here. Matter of fact, there's like a restaurant with a whole mini uh, amusement park for kids. I'm going to walk by that in a minute. It's like a horse ride. So last night on Saturday, I was over here and I was here a little bit later. Um, it, it might be that Sunday is a little bit more busy, busier right now than Saturday was. Uh, this is, uh, you know, this is. This is the extent, kind of, bad habit of uh, kind of a trendy bar with a nightclub kind of vibe to it. Uh, most of the places here are very <laughs> family oriented and uh, I would say definitely a, a older crowd. It's not uh, 18 to 25 year old kids coming here or anything like that. They go to the islands for that. No, thank you. So, and so here's the place I'm talking about. So this is a good idea. It's like a restaurant, but then you just let your kids go run around and do their thing while you get to hang out and talk with your friends or family or whatever, and you don't have to worry about them and they're not going to be sitting around saying I'm bored or something like that. So, and there's more back there. Looks like some kind of, I don't know, racing thing or something. But, uh, so there, yeah, there's a lot to do for kids out here. So, I would say this is a very, very nice vacation spot for 
families or anybody that just wants a kind of very calm, nice place where you don't have to worry about anything, Calamata uh, seems like that to me. I think it is more crowded than last night. So, on the other side of these restaurants is, is the water, and uh, a little up more is where it, where it has better beaches. Right here is still kind of like docks and some rocks in the water and some jetties and stuff like that. But uh, a little up more is really good swimming. And if you're sitting at one of these restaurants, you have the really nice view of the lights from the houses in the mountains back there. Some people even sitting on the beach, some people even swimming, it looks like. Yeah, so I swam from in front of this hotel, Austria, the other day. And so the good thing about these places here, they give you a beach chair and umbrella, and all you gotta do is buy something. Even if it's like a three euro beer or coffee or something like that, and you got free use of the chair and umbrella all day. So this whole uh, street could be summed up as Greek food places uh, combined with pizza, combined with bakeries, ice cream stores, and a few hotels here and there. So guys, that's a look at what's going on on the Kalamata waterfront here in the beginning of September. It's not too late to come out here. The water's good, the temperature's good, and there's still a lot of people out here. So come check it out if you're thinking about it. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one.